Hi, this is Helen from Communicarb and today I'm going to be doing an expressive painting using soft pastels. Here's the photograph and here's my final sketch that I did very quickly. Let me go straight away to what we call the underpainting of one of these um, paintings. First of all, a whole selection of colours around. All I'm doing is literally filling the page with basic colours that I want to use. As I said, this is an underpainting. It's nowhere near the final stages. So I just want to fill the surface with energetic mark making and just the basic colours. Now, what I'm going to do with these colours is get a bristle brush afterwards, you'll see it has to be bristle, and I'm going to go over all of this colour with alcohol. So definitely no detail, nothing like that. There's my cup with the bristle brush, and I'm just going to cover it all with the alcohol um, substance. We can now start a layering process to gain a really sort of dynamic, expressive effect. The alcohol and the pastel give a very dry, sort of scratchy surface to work on. But I find it excellent because the pastel that I'm applying now, just with my hands and, you know, with the, with the chalk itself, it really does um, hold on to the texture, that textured dry paper. So here now I can start, um, as I move on, just um, adding more and more colour to the image. As I'm working, sometimes I even spray the painting, leave it to dry, then come back to it. And once again, I'm left with that dry, wonderful surface to apply more colour over top. This isn't really a drawing. It's very much a painting, but I'm not using wet pigment and um, a paintbrush. The only difference is that I'm using this dry pigment. It's really great for initial sketches, um, if you want to try out a composition, if you want to sort out some colours. It's so quick and it's so fluid and easy. Um, I really urge you to give this a try. I'm just going over now into the sky, giving, bringing out some whiteness. Um, in the sky here and it's just like I said a constant process of layering spraying layering and spraying until at the end I've got this sort of like more wispy sky feel here a little bit more atmospheric a little bit more dramatic and I'm just putting the final touches I hope you've enjoyed this short hot hat. If you're interested in learning about my in-person and online courses, please subscribe to my newsletter. You'll find the details below.